Good morning. Coffee. Probably should be tea, but I don't want no tea. So, y'all being sick is not fun at all. If you've been sick, then you know that. I'm just. Royalty doesn't really have um, an appetite like that. Um, so she's just drinking a lot of like ginger ale, water, and stuff like that. So as long as she's staying hydrated. Um, my husband's sick also. He went to work while he was sick and just pushed through. I don't really like when he has to do that because if you're not in good condition to help yourself, how are you going to help patients and other people, you know? So, but these jobs, you know, they don't be caring. They just want to get the job done. That's why the goal is to be your own boss. And, um, but yeah, so... He came home last night with some Theraflu. I took a nighttime Theraflu. He took one. And then we laid down and went to sleep. <sighs> but like in the middle of the night, the getting up, the can't breathe, the nose stuffed up. It's just the coffin, the chest. And, um, yeah. That part. So, I just got up this morning and I said, oh, I'm going to make a big pot of some good chicken soup. I can't, I could barely taste. And I cannot cook my food without tasting. <laughs> I got to taste something. So... And then, also my son, he got a cold... He seems to be managing okay. Um, I did put him on the machine because he is asthmatic, even though he hasn't had any type of um, attacks or anything or flare-ups. But I still put him on the machine with the saline because the salt water, that's all saline really is. Salt and solution. Whatever solution they mix it with. Um, it helps loosen up the congestion. So he, um, I put him on it. Um, my husband also went on it. Royalty went on it. I'm the only one who hasn't gone on it. And, um, yeah. So right now I'm just preparing my portion of the breakfast. Which is sachets and eggs. And my husband is going to do the fried dumpling. So, even though you're sick, you still got to get up and do what you got to do, right? So, Royce did. Royce and my son missed school Thursday, Friday. And I um, did say that if they were not well by at least today then I would take them to their doctor tomorrow. I don't know how it works in New York, but, you know, the kids can't just be missing school because they're sick. I mean, obviously they have to miss school because they are sick, but they also want a letter stating that, you know, you did bring them to the doctor, a doctor's note or something that just, because you don't take your kids to school over here in New York. Boop, boop. You know, they get them people involved quick, fast. But my kids also do have a good record of going to school. So if they're not in school, you know something is wrong. Mm -hmm. Those are for drastic um, situations. But yeah, so most likely I will bring them to the doctor, their doctor tomorrow as a walk-in. And um, just see what she says. And then... Probably bring them the letter 
Tuesday. Because probably she's going to say, um, don't allow them to go to school until maybe like Wednesday. So Thursday, Friday. Thursday, Friday, Monday, Tuesday. That's four days out of school. Too many days for me. But... Yes. So, satchels are cut up. They're really good. They're these. My mother hates them. <laughs> she hates them. I don't know if he wants them scrambled or what. I don't know. <coughs> so, I wonder, have y'all ever heard of the, um, it's a, uh, oh, my back is hurting my lower back. Oh gosh. Oh. Oh God. I feel like my joints, my bones, everything is bothering me. And I did take a COVID test. It's not COVID. Oh. What was I about to ask y'all? Have y'all ever heard of um Goku? Goku.com is where you can watch like all exclusive movies. They have everything on there that you could think of. Even the movies that's in the theater. And I noticed this morning. It's called Goku.com. I'm going to put it right here. I noticed this morning they had Beetlejuice on there. So um, I want to see Beetlejuice. Um, you want to see it? Yeah. So. But you guys. I am. I don't know what to do. Babe! My body is just, like, aching. It's just aching. I keep rubbing my toe. I don't know what this lady did to my toe. <laughs> At the, where the cuticles are. It's like, I don't know if she took some skin off. But it hurts. I can't. Yeah, so also happy Sunday. I was going to tell y'all happy Sunday. I hope everybody has a day that they deserve today. And um, I hope everybody is well. Everybody's in good health. And, you know, all that good stuff. <laughs> Yesterday, my mother called me. No, did she call me? I called her. Yesterday, I called my mother. You would have thought she was having a baby. That lady. And you know what? Because I was talking, my phone was charging, and I was on my laptop talking to her. If I was on my phone, I would have screen recorded. I would have screen recorded. My mother was in there like she was having contractions. Like, uh, oh, oh, uh, she, I'm like, and I'm thinking it's the appendix, but I think it was just some food poisoning, but <laughs> I was just there looking out, but I wish I would have screen recorded so I could put a little clip right here so y'all can see what I'm talking about. My mother is too much, but she's feeling much better. I'm happy because she was in pain. I don't like to see my mother in pain like that. If my mother's in pain, she's in pain. Because there's not really much that go on with her in that type of way. <laughs> but, yeah. So, let me just take a minute to myself real quick before I start up breakfast. And wait for my husband to come out the bathroom. And, yeah, so we can get this breakfast started. Thank <sighs> you.
We're starting breakfast. These were boiled dumplings. My husband cut them in half. He said real yarn man style. Right, babe? Yep. So, and then we're going to have some sachets and some eggs. If you know, you know. Because he made mackerel with dumpling the other day. So, we just took the boiled dumpling to fry it for breakfast. So... And it be busting. Okay, y'all. So breakfast is done. This is what it is. You got sweet plantain. You got fried egg. You have fried dumpling, which was cut in half. It was boiled dumpling with mackerel, but my husband remixed the ting, Jamaican style, and sachets. So yeah. Okay, so we're about to eat now and watch. Um, what's the name of this movie? Rebel Ridge. It's a new movie on Netflix, so I catch up with y'all later. Y'all, because <laughs> now it's hours later, obviously. <sighs> I decided I'm gonna send these kids to school. They seem pretty active. That they could go to school. You're not going. You're not eating your food. Okay. Yeah, so everybody is getting ready to take a shower, get ready for bed, school tomorrow. Mm -mm. Yes, and no. um, no. my back is hurting me. My throat no. is no. still a little itchy. I'm still sneezing, but <coughs> now here, here the dramatics I'm in this, <laughs> in this one. Stop. So, yeah, and I'm hungry, but I don't know what I want to eat. I don't know. Yeah, so I had a pretty big breakfast, so that kind of lasted me through the entire day. But I don't know what to eat right now. It's like I want something. I kind of wanted some Spanish food, but I don't know. So, yeah. And my husband is trying to help me figure it out. <laughs> yes, babe. <laughs> He's asking me right now. You figured out what you want to eat? But wait, man, we so indecisive when it comes to food. I don't know why. It's like I'm hungry. I know I want food, but I don't know what to eat. <sighs> Anywho. I'm going to love y'all and leave y'all right here because... After Royalty finished eating her dinner, she's taking a shower, she's going to bed. I'm going to read her a book. I do every night. And that'll be that. I don't know. I guess eventually I'll get something to eat. I guess. <laughs> All right. I love you guys. Make sure you like, share, subscribe. Make sure you comment down below because I do like to interact with the family. And make sure you like up this video. Make sure you are turning on your post notifications so when I post a video you can pull up and yes and y'all please pray for me because I want to get better I don't like being sick yeah girl's birthday is next week so I can't afford to be sick I'm trying to be outside a little bit <laughs> all right good night guys